Was that the special Dutch charm I heard so much about? Relax. You looking for a problem? I got this. Oh my god. Holy crap, I'm in Bronte's house. I'm in Bronte's house. Okay, this is what is going on. Don't worry, boys. We come in peace. We just uh, need to straighten a couple of things out with your boss. Um... Wait. Oh, okay. Oh my god, no way am I in this cutscene. The bird is not in the cutscene. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? I said, why? Yes, why do, why do I look like a fish? We ain't got no problems with you. Yes, we have no problem with you, sir. Like, like I don't look like a bird. I look like absolutely deformed. Oh my god, what is this? This looks so stupid. You ask me to show compassion. Have I not shown you almost infinite compassion already by simply allowing you to breathe in my presence? Um. We are simple country folk. Yes. All we have Very simple. is each other. And you have gone, and you have took his son. You had nothing to do with destroying the liquor business. We was innocent. Listen, I know this is supposed to be a tense scene, but but this bird is really throwing me off. No, but I mean seriously, like when you're a bird in this game, it's a lot more fun. It's a lot more fun than being in human form, let me tell you that. When you're a bird, you get to better appreciate details that wouldn't exist if you were to be in your human form. For example, you get to look at roofs that you would never be able to climb on top of as Arthur. Look at this roof over here. Plain as day. Look at this. I've never even seen this before. This is like a balcony on top of this building here. You would never be able to access this as Arthur. All right. So with this bird, I want to first see how high I can go. All right. Let's go, bird. Ascend to the heavens. Let's go. We're going to heaven. We're going to see God. Oh my God, holy crap, we're getting high. It's weird with this mod, like sometimes the bird goes out of frame, like like that. Did you see that? It, it, it totally freaks me out. Hey, it looks like he's struggling a bit. His wings are flapping a bit harder. I mean, I'm not a scientist or anything, but the air pressure gets really low as you get higher in the sky, right? Uh, is, there, is there like a sky barrier in this game? Gosh, what happens if I hit it? Will the bird die? Okay, I think I've finally reached the barrier. It will not let me go higher than this. I have been spared though. I'm not dying or anything, it's just like, I just can't go any higher than this. Okay, well, I'm pretty satisfied. I mean, this is, holy crap. Like, I can see like, almost the entire map from up here. All right, well, moving past all of that, let's go visit the gang. Let's see how they're doing. Hello gang, how is everyone doing? Pearson? Oh, oh, Arthur! Oh, uh, what? You smell. How is everyone doing? Oh, hello, Mary Beth. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, holy crap. I'm entering some interesting places right now. Let's go inside the house. Can I make it inside the house? Let's get in here. Oh, would you look at that? I can open the door. Oh, gosh. Okay, oh my gosh. What the? Okay. Yeah, no, I think trying to control the bird in that house, it's just, it's just not possible. Therefore, I don't think there's much for us at this camp. It's the most thing I'm scared of. Holy crap. I've just entered the underworld. Okay. This is creepy. All right, come back up. Come back up. There's no reason for us to be underneath the world. Come on. He said the strangest things about all manner of bad things happening in town. Maybe if you're there, you could have a chat with him. He's hanging about outside. Okay, the okay, place. Reverend, we get it. I understand, Reverend. You stop. Can you please stop stepping on me, please? You're you, you're continuing to step on me, and it's really hurting me. Okay, so I am now a hawk. Arthur. What Arthur. The... Up here. Oh, hey, Mary. You came. Yes. Yeah. I did okay. come. Yes. <laughs> Wait there! I'm coming straight down! Jeez, why? What is up with the birds looking all distorted in cutscenes? 
Arthur. Ah, yes, Mary. Hello, Mary. You came. Uh, sorry I didn't make it when last you wrote. Uh, oh, Arthur. What's wrong? Daddy. <laughs> Your father? I'm a bigger fool than I even thought. Oh, uh, yeah, let's get out of here. I'm begging you, Arthur. I know Daddy was not kind to you. Why? But because I'm a bird? Sure. And wanting better for her than... A bird. Than... Then the choices you what make. What choice did I have? Listen, I didn't did choose I to oh, be a bird, okay? You... Well, listen, I am what I am, and I'm not going to change that. Be kind to me. No. It wasn't that I didn't love you, Arthur. It was because I'm a bird. Think how different life could have been. Yeah, I think about it. A lot. You look like a turkey from this angle. Seem so. Will you help me try to save Daddy? <sighs> All right. Come on, then. Don't be a pompous ass, Arthur. It doesn't... I don't have an ass. All right, let's go get this guy. Oh. All right. I'm old nag. Standing? He's usually falling down. Yeah. Arthur. He wasn't always this way. <laughs> it's the stupidest but thing I've ever done. Look, she has to run worse. to keep up with me. Oh, don't worry too much. Whatever it is, we'll work it out. Yes, we will work it out, Mary. Do not worry. All right, let's do this. Let me go in and see what kind of a state he's in. Okay. Sure. I'll wait here. Good luck. Yeah. Don't worry about Even it. If you need any help. Very funny. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing's more terrifying than this. You can't stand there. What? What, in the street? Yes, in the street. Is it your street? <laughs> Just get out of here. <laughs> Why? I said... Just get out of here. Oh. Listen, Don't mess partner. with me. Don't mess with the bird. I'm waiting on the lady. She's a fine lady. She's just gone inside. God, I love the way the bird's clawing onto his arm. You'd be dead already. Yeah, that's right, mister. But if you continue to irritate me, <laughs> I'll kill you. I make my apologies to the lady. That Dude, you his call. face oh, makes so nothing. much sense. You can sense how horrified he is. Damn nuisance. Excuse me, partner. Yeah, excuse You're me. Charming as ever, I see. Oh, Arthur, he's up to no good. We better follow him. Let's go. Don't worry, Mary. We'll handle this. Hey, oh crap! Oh what? crap! How dare you follow me? I'm not following you. Don't I'm tell a me. bird. Go back. All right. What in the hell? Is happening now. He just went left down that alleyway. No, but like, what's he doing? I legitimately do not know what is happening. <laughs> this is reaching new levels of craziness. What the hell is wrong with this hawk right now? What in the what's heck? What's he doing? Um. Okay. Why is Arthur's hair connected to the hawk? Oh my gosh. Himself killed. You don't understand. Mother left it to me. You well, sold listen. my oh mother's my brooch. How could you? You. That's theft. I, I see you found your outlaw again. Hello, sir. Have you been well? Daddy, how could you? Mary, wait here. I'll go get the brooch. Yeah, don't, don't deal. Hurt anyone, don't worry Arthur. about it. I would never dream of such. A okay, now Arthur's head is connected. Okay, this is the weirdest thing. What? <laughs> so weird. Hey, you, Ash! Hold it right there! Yeah, you stop. You stop it. Damn it. I, get on the horse. Stop that coach! Okay, for some reason, for some reason, I can't fly anymore, so I'm on a horse with Arthur's head and a hawk's bird body. Uh, honestly, I never thought, I never thought I would ever be doing this in Red Dead Redemption 2. Yes, come on. Let's deal with this guy. Yes. <laughs> it looks like a spider. It looks like a Leave spider. Me Leave me alone. It's just a brooch. I want that brooch. Give it, it here. It wasn't Gillis's to sell. Give it to you for a hundred dollars? No. A hundred? What do you take me for? Okay, okay. Uh, I'm a reasonable man. Let's say fifty. Nope. I couldn't take I the damn thing. 
fucking crazy son of a bitch. Yeah, you better you believe it. What was that? Was that Somebody's a threat? Gonna pay for this. Was that a threat? Yeah, that's right. Well, that was Red Dead Redemption 2 from the perspective of a bird. Very interesting way to play the game. I totally recommend it. 10 out of 10.